Hello, this is IPSer, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! Since last time, you all got to hear me sing like... I don't even know what, so... There'll be some more this episode, too! Ooh. And, oh no, a letter from Ultros. Let's look at Locke. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure you had all the right equipment. Okay. What? Impossibly! Attack! And thus, a war. Whoa! More singing. harder to keep up with. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't even hardly try there. That's too hard to keep up with. Alright. Oh no. Ultras is gonna push something on Celeste. <laughs> It'll take me five minutes. We haven't a second to lose. Alright, so we'll go pay them a visit in our five minute spam. And for some reason, Edgar's our leader. Oh well. Go, Edgar, go! Far right switch, okay. Okay, thank you. Now let's go to the room on the left to see if it changed anything so we can get over there to Ultros and put a stop to him. Okay. Let's hurry. <laughs> Yay. It worked. Now these little things here are encounters. Yeah, I don't know how he did that. Took him out easy, didn't we? More jeez. Ah, oh, dang. Let's just take them out then. We should be able to make it. We don't have to beat the boss within the time limit as well. Yeah. And yeah, you have to fight Ultros for a second time. No, not again. I hate random encounters. Let's use the flash on them, get them out easy. Get him! Yay! Ah. Oh crap, this is a bigger group. Do you not agree with me, viewers? Do you not agree with me? Let's just chainsaw on one of them. Just to take them out easier. He puts on a Jason mask whenever he instantly kills it. Yeah. I realize that. Hey, you! Fatty, out of my way! Oh no. Ah. Oh. Have everybody talk for a while. Background, you can hear that. Disaster. He 
makes a big deal out of everything. Celeste, way to go, Locke. <laughs> what awful acting. Now it's man versus octopus. Get special boss music for the second bot um fight against Ultras. Okay, so let's throw a blitz off on him, and let's see if we can steal anything from him. Okay, we get some good damage from that. Drill. He doesn't have anything. Don't have anything that good. Okay. Let's just use a potion. Now... Ultras here is weak against Bolt, so you can throw Bolt 2 off with um, whoever has Bolt 2, in this case, Locke and Edgar, but of course it'll do over 1,000 damage there. And there we go, we got him. Yeah, he's not that hard at all. Got 2 GP for it, too. That's pretty good. Usually you only get 1 random encounters. <clears throat> oh no, Setster music. A whole awesome setster. <laughs> Music man, that's him. What a reversal thinking she's Locke's new queen. Maria is instead napped by setster. Okay. That was a energetic show, don't you agree? Hey, kicked her. I'll deal with you in a minute. Open up, open up. Hey, open up. Aww. Weak. Let's go over here and drag these three out. Performance enough already. Yeah, where is Setzer? He's coming. You're not Maria. Oh, that's mean, Setzer. Come on. Yeah. Huh. Throwing that off on him, are you? Um, Edgar. I'm the King of Figaro. Okay. Now we're on his airship. There's not much to do right now. Let's just go ahead and talk to Setzer here. Yeah. Listen to the woman. Until recently. Yeah, the Empire will end up owning you! The Empire. Evil? Evil Empire, yes. Hey, Stunning. Well, I do have a slight case of the runs. 
Okay, that was another one of my random statements that did not even make sense. I do not have the runs. Just I ignore that! Okay, that hurts my head even thinking about it. Yes, it's settled. But I have conditions. Psst, psst, psst. Okay. Thank you. We'll decide with a coin toss. If it's heads, you'll help us. If it's tails, I'll go with you. Well, Mr. Gambler, Fun, I accept. <sighs> My bad. Ready, set, go! Ding, 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 ding. I win. Now, honor your part on the bargain. How unusual! A coin with identical sides, that coin! Big Brother, don't tell me! Haha, <laughs> if you have Sabin and Edgar in your party, you'll get that. Of course, you remember the, um... Well, you don't remember this, this, but you if you had Edgar and Sabin at the coin, um, Figaro back there where I didn't have them and I told you I'd probably do a bonus episode, they had a scene where they flipped a coin and, um, it was if, um, they had flipped a coin and Edgar won. I don't really remember what it was for, but Edgar won and he used that double-sided coin to win and now Sabin knows that. <laughs> that was, I, I loved that. Could it crash? It's a matter of fate. That's... That's nice to know. <laughs> okay, so... And yes, that's an, also a thing I like about Final Fantasy um 6 here. Unlike the other ones, 1 through 5, how the flying the airship was, this is the first one to start it off looking like this. Yeah. Where it's all like, yeah, like this, you know what I mean? I like that. Yeah. I'm tired. What in the world? It's a factory. Of course, as um, Locke said, we might want to land a little bit far away. Looks really cool. It's not a factory. What am I saying? Okay, so we're next to the town of Albrook. All right, so you, actually, this is an imperial place, but you can still get some um some weapons. Okay, you got the forged claw here. I mean, poison claw. I got forged still, so, and the EP sword. Really good attack power for Edgar and. Celeste there, so I'm gonna get that. And stuff for Shadow if you had him. Yeah. Okay, so let's throw these on, on them. It's a good thing I remembered that. That uh, took off all of her crap before last episode. Okay, give her that. Give her the green beret bag and the uh, white dress. EP. Um, poison claw. Okay, there we go. Um, Blossom for if you had, it's really good attack power for if you had Shadow and uh, this stuff if you had Shadow, so. Yeah, will we get better stuff? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! This is IPSer signing out.